the Clavy River watershed forms a unique and undivided landscape in the heart of the Sierra Nevada. Unobstructed by dams, the free-flowing Clavy River begins its journey high in the Sierra Nevada mountains as melting snow. For 47 miles, its descending course touches every aspect of Sierra Nevada natural history, from the alpine flowers and bell meadows to the weathered chaparral-covered slopes of Jawbone Ridge. It is within this 9,000-foot descent that the clavy waters grow in volume and force, fed by the numerous creeks that empty into it. The clavy's final destination is the Tuolumne River. Here, in a dramatic descent, the river thunders full force over clavy falls, delivering all her water into the Tuolumne. Even the magnificent Tuolumne River owes its grandeur in part to the breadth and length of the clavy's defining watershed which encompasses over 100,000 acres laced with meadows, springs, and creeks. This vast amount of unfragmented landscape also represents a rich biological connectivity between the two rivers, putting habitat on a life-sustaining scale for deer herds, mountain lions, river otters, and the elusive ringtail cat. The environmental integrity of the Clavy watershed directly contributes to the vitality of the Tuolumne River, a designated wild and scenic river. The Clavy River watershed is located within the Stanislaus National Forest, due east of San Francisco Bay and just north of Yosemite National Park in the Sierra Nevada Mountains. One can travel there via Highway 108 through Sonora or by Highway 120 through Groveland. The beauty and diversity of the Clavy River can be experienced in all seasons and at all elevations. Its accessibility and remoteness offers visitors a chance to find the perfect swimming hole for the day or backpack deep into its canyon recesses for fishing or solitude. The Clavy River Ecosystem Project or CREP, is a community collaboration of individual stakeholders providing volunteer efforts to protect the watershed and ensure the continued use and enjoyment of the watershed's varied resources. With input from the public, CREP developed a vision to help guide the project. Vision. The Clavy River watershed is a sustainable ecosystem that exemplifies both a natural wild and scenic character and addresses changing socio-cultural needs. Watershed Assessment CREP provides a steering committee that represents different stakeholders' points of view to guide the three-year watershed assessment project. This assessment measures the biological condition and social values that affect the environmental condition of the watershed. Partnership between land managers and stakeholders the results of the assessment will help shape the future of the Clavy Watershed. Supporting partners include CalFed Bay Delta for providing grant funding for conducting the assessment through the State Water Resources Board. The Tuolumne River Trust administers the grant and the Stanislaus National Forest provides help in data collection and research. The future of the Clavy depends on all of us. No single entity has all the answers. It takes a collaborative voice rooted in common sense and seeking common ground to find the balance between human uses and resource viability. To view the Clavy watershed is to experience geologic time itself. Within its stones are the stories of how the Sierra was formed. What the seas and volcanoes deposited, ice eroded and sculpted. These episodes were repeated on an unimaginable scale of millions of years and as the Sierra uplifted along its eastern fault lines. Today, in lower reaches of the Clavy, one can see the weathered slates derived from the rocks fully 200 million years old when the Sierra was covered by the sea. In the high country, the immense granite expanses and domes were formed when vast amounts of molten granite were injected into and under the overlying folded strata 100 million years ago. This material crystallized as a huge mass of solid rock. 
It was this unrelenting granite that tested the determination of the pioneers and immigrants who came west. For thousands of years, the Clavy River has carved its course through the geologic strata. As events and climate stabilized, rain and snowmelt became channeled within the terrain. Like the image of a branching tree, these channels collect and funnel water down towards a main trunk, the Clavy River. This is called a watershed. The Clavy River watershed starts as the headwaters of Bell and Lily Creeks in the granite of Immigrant Wilderness Area. Where these two creeks come together is the beginning of the Clavy River itself. As the Clavy flows south towards the Tuolumne River, it is joined in added to by such tributary creeks as Two Mile, Rock, Trout, Reeds, Reynolds, and Borland Creeks before reaching the confluence with the Tuolumne River at the Clavy Falls. Like the evolution of animal adaptation to the land and climate, the process of erosion for these waterways took eons to form into what we see today. It has always been both slow and in balance with itself. The first stewards and protectors of this balance, however, were not the people that oversee it today. <laughs>